from your fan club here. Brandon asks, uh, Brandon wants to know, um, he says, I've been a long time fan, and I just want to know how, after all the bad press, you can keep going and doing the best job that any rock star can do. Is it the fact that you have such a wonderful wife supporting you? Or are there other reasons you stay so damn great? <laughs> <laughs> that little southern thing in there. Okay. Um, despite of what the press say about celebrities or myself in general, uh, I move ahead. I don't pay attention to it because it's garbage, it's tabloid junk, and it's not important to me. Um, I have my dreams, I'm a visionary, and uh, I'm very resilient, and nothing can hurt me. I feel as if I have a suit of armor on. Uh, I have rhinoceros skin, and I'm here to do what I'm supposed to do <laughs> the best way I can. And um, thank you for asking the first question. That's Florida. Is that Florida? Oh, boy. If you could be any superhero, like Batman, Superman, whom would you choose to be and why? Gee, I like Batman a lot. Uh, but if I had to choose one to be, I like um, Morph from the, uh, the X-Men, because, M yeah, M.O.R. Peach, <laughs> because he's constantly transforms himself. He could become anything, and when you're not expecting him, he's there, and he's very mysterious, and I think he can even teleport, which is exciting to me, and be in one place at one moment and another place at another moment. And he can be all things, become all things. That's, that's exciting to me. So I think I like more. He's not as popular as the others, but that's why he's exciting. <laughs> Michael, Darkham would like to know, are you ever going to tour America? Am I ever going to tour America? I'm not exactly sure. Uh, we don't really know where we're going to tour next in general. We kind of play it by ear. It's kind of uh, spontaneous. Um, it would be nice, but I'm not sure. 